Hey everyone, hi, how are you? Um, I'm Winter. Thank you so much for uh, clicking on this video. So a, <clears throat> a subscriber of this channel, as well as one of my regular um, uh, clients has um, uh, given me this idea to do daily um, angel card messages to just pull one card for a daily um, message. So that's what I'm going to do um, for you guys from now on. We're going to start adding like a, a, a daily message. It'll be like a one minute maybe two minute message only um, instead of, you know, just doing one, one deck, I'm going to, um, I've got three uh, different decks here for you to choose from. And um, it'll just be like a daily message that um, that'll be posted every morning. Um, but that's not going to replace like our uh, regular like uh, um, in depth uh, readings that I do for you guys. So, um, this is just going to be like a little daily thing for you to <clears throat> not only, um, uh, practice connecting with your own intuition, um, but also like getting that little daily, um, connection with your angels and your spirit team. So, um, if you'd like, you can take a moment and look at the cards here to see, you know, which deck you feel drawn to or which crystal you feel most drawn to. And um, you can also like uh, uh, go to Google, <clears throat> excuse me, and and punch in like the the um, free uh, number generator and just put, you know, three as being the max and then, um, uh, you know, just click it and it'll give you a random number and then you can go with that. Uh, or if you feel drawn, you know, to, to more than one, choose more than one. But uh, anyways, I'm just going to take a moment and clear out the energy here. Thank you, Divine Source Energy, Divine Holy Spirit. Thank you, Angels, Archangels, Ascendant Masters of Love and Light, Ancestors of the Highest Good, Angelic, Cosmic, Galactic, Benevolent, Higher Light Beings. For the good of all and to the harm of none, I call upon you now and invite you here uh, to be with me for this reading that I will do for the collective of souls that find their way here. May the messages received here today be of value and really make a difference for those that find their way here. I thank you for honest, accurate, trustworthy answers and messages that come only from the divine, that are only of the highest good and to the harm of none, with peace, love, light, and gratitude, so it is. Namaste. Okay, you guys, so let's get your daily message and we're going to start here with this purple deck, which is, um, the, it's actually called the daily guidance, um, uh, daily guidance from your angels. And then we will do the, um, angels and archangels deck and then the angel therapy. So let's go ahead. We're just going to, and I'm going to do my best to make it short and sweet, you guys. So, for those of you who chose, you may be um, dreaming about love or like there may be um, just this kind of uh, uh, dreamy, illusionary, or like a dreamy, I don't want to say illusionary, but... Um, I don't know, just this kind of like daydreaming about like what you, uh, the ideal partner or um, your current partner for some. Okay, what is the daily message here for those that uh, chose this daily guidance, Oracle deck, spirit, angels? What do the angels want to say? Okay, we're just gonna go ahead and pull this one. Oh, see only love. What did I tell you? It was like this like dreamy, um, like daydreamy 
energy regarding love, but it says, look past the seeming errors, mistakes, and misunderstandings, and see only the love within each person, including yourself. Your resolute focus upon the love that underlies every situation brings about healing in unconditional ways. So, what your angels are trying to tell you for your daily message here is to really um, look past like all of those, um, you know, mistakes, like your own personal mistakes or or um, other people's um, uh, uh, failures or, you know, the things that you feel that they've done wrong or any kind of um, misunderstandings, you know, the, the, any kind of like anger or regret. Uh, uh, aggression even that that you may feel towards certain people or, or you know certain situations and in this is like spirit saying like love is really all there is you know the angels are just trying to tell you love is all there is and that's all you know you really just need to focus on right now it's like I, I know it may sound kind of cliche or or whatever it may sound like but that's what it's like that's what they're saying you know like only see only allow yourself to just focus on love you know it's like see yourself and see others through um through the eyes of love is what is what I'm feeling it's like when you focus on love like everything um just kind of falls away everything else just kind of falls away and if you have love like that's all you really need you know so um you you may want to focus on like um this person here is is like raised up higher so like elevating y your vision you know and like seeing things from a more loving standpoint you know so like maybe even looking past other people's like um personalities looking past the ego and really seeing the soul and, and the soul is created from pure pure love this is a, a an, an energy of like letting go of anger of resentment or any kind of judgments you know and just um really focusing more on what you desire and what you love instead of like what you fear okay and i could go just so much deeper into that but we're, i'm going to keep to my word all right for those of you who chose this angels and archangels deck spirit show me clearly what daily message do you have do the angels have for whoa this one i just kicked it so we're gonna do oh my god the theme so far is love um, and this is um, the Archangel of Unconditional Love. This is relationship repair. This is healing broken hearts. And the way that I just accidentally, you know, kicked that. And it's card number 28, which would reduce to a 10. Um, and 10s are all about like endings and new beginnings, completion, closing out cycles. And so this is like maybe restoring balance within a relationship um, with a family member, uh, like a romantic relationship. And it says, I foster harmonious relationships by filling hearts with compassion and love. I also help soulmates, soulmates uh, unite. And I was actually about to say reunite. So some of you may actually be... Um, reuniting with it with a, a, a romantic partner or this is like maybe someone that you're having some sort of dispute with a, some sort of conflict or tension or turmoil this may even be um like uh within your own self and if you are single and you have not met like the one um then then this is definitely like um, a very good time. Like this is a very auspicious time and a very good time for you to meet that um, that soulmate. And so like uh, regardless, um, this is uh, Simiel and, and she actually focuses on filling your heart with unconditional love. Um, they're playing that song in my head again listen to your heart 
what it's telling you. I don't know how it goes. And I ain't even going to try to sing because I can't sing. But so like if you've been dealing with a broken heart though, or like if you've been um, uh, in a place of sorrow or sadness, I feel there's this soothing um, energy that's going to come in because I really feel this very like soft glowing energy from this card so i'm i'm sensing like some softness being brought in it's like you're you're going to be soothed whether or not that's someone else that's going to come in and help you know bring solace or this is you um uh finding a way to really soothe your own heart um but yeah if you've been um it's like you're you're going to um there's a sense of like helping to like heal uh, a broken heart or like, uh, and it says compromise here. So there may be like, um, you know, you and someone coming together to, to squash something and to um, resolve some sort of tension or rift within, within a connection. Uh, whether that be a f friend, family member, or romantic partner. But that's so cool that both of those, like, it, literally out of all those cards, it could have been anything. Okay. And for those of you who chose the angel therapy, oh, wow. Those of you who chose the angel therapy, you're um, definitely healers. Um, and we've got Archangel Raphael, which is is the archangel of of healing and and it says the healing angel is with you supporting your healing work and then the third eye chakra and it says it is safe for you to see the energy of love in all its forms such as angels auras and visions so it is safe for you to see love it is safe for you to to use your um your spiritual gifts to see into the realm of spirit and that there's nothing to be afraid of that the only thing that is surrounding you right now is love i'm definitely picking up this in energy of you know um kissing and making up and feeling safe uh, to love, safe to um, use your spiritual gifts, safe for you to heal others. Some of you may still have like some fears regarding like um, spirituality, the occult, or like your own spiritual gifts. Show me clearly what do the angels, what daily message do the angels have for those that chose this angel therapy deck? And we have release. So your daily message is um, to, to learn to let go. And it says, work with Archangel Michael to let go of what no longer serves you on your purpose. Or that no longer serves you or your purpose. So this may be anger, resentment that you could be feeling because it does feel like a theme. So you know, there may be someone in your life that is, um, trying to control you, trying to control your situation, call, um, uh, trying to, um, instill anger or fear. This could even be you yourself. Some of you, this is, um, like, uh, health, health related issues, because we did see the Archangel Raphael at first. So it's like Archangel Raphael and Archangel Michael are definitely working together. It's like when you see different doctors coming together to work together to heal a patient, that's what I'm seeing. That's what it feels like here. It's like there's these two doctors that are coming together, you know, these, there's specialists coming together to heal what ails you. And so, um, but Archangel Michael is like, you know, the, um, he's like your spiritual surgeon, so to speak, you know? So like, he's gonna cut away, um, and remove any of these things that don't serve you, but you at the same time need to, uh, give him permission. So just, you know, saying, Archangel Michael, today I allow you to help me release things that are not of my highest good or that are no longer serving me. Maybe there's something that has served you in, at one time but no longer is, you know. So, um, so this could even be, um, though, 
this is something here about your purpose or your life purpose, or maybe you're feeling intimidated about moving forward in your life. Maybe it's regarding a relationship um, or career or something here. And so maybe you're feeling blocked or, you know, um, you're feeling as though you're not really understanding your mission or, or what this life is for actually. Um, maybe, um, but whatever it is, it's like there, there's some concerns that, um, has really triggered Archangel Michael, uh, to come and assist you. So he wants you to know that he's here, like your fears actually triggered him into action. And so like your higher self is already aware of your, your mission and has everything under control and is ready to move you forward but you know you just have to trust that and just you know um allow this guidance to to happen you know your daily guidance is to allow yourself to be guided by your higher self right now and um know that there is this unlimited amount of support around you right now and michael is helping you to release anything that is standing in your way you know like any kind of ego based type concerns that is is hindering you so um so yeah just don't let that ego or fears stand in your way today so this is what i have for you guys please let me know how you like this um so i pro i will definitely get a you know um kind of switch things around a little bit but it's difficult for me to to do short short messages but i'm gonna do my best to make them short and sweet for a daily message for you and you guys let me know if you like the pick a card if you just rather me just do one deck and pull one message but uh anyways i'm just you know kind of trying to figure out how i want to do this so anyways i'm gonna leave that there and the divine in me bows to the divine in you namaste